You know, 50 percent of the whistles in this game they should let go i think so too too many aggressively by gibson back to kg side going to the strong side getting the ball and moving without it Morris hangs fires no Those things kills the team teague firing Finish. Dang it back in a hurry. Lee takes the jumper anyway. No. Teague. Houston, he gives him a big line of defense. He knows how to move without the ball. Challenge. I have to breathe through that. A sheep well there for a long time. You just can't say that. Your role is just to play hard and win. Situation because they use it as leverage. And when he was able to uh, get all the way to the basket. But uh, Boozer then went on to make another hustle play, getting another possession on that last time. Houston led by 35 and kept uh, the margin in the Bulls in that second quarter. Morris lead by the Rockets with seven. There's a sheet. Just talk about the Chicago Bulls running their offense through him. If you would have said that a couple
Jason Terry, nice little move to the hoop. Came out. But still found friend. Now you've got Mayo on a drive. Three-point try. Padre talked about with Dang. Now in a switch, Harris comes off the Horford screen. Pick and pop for Al. And they're banging against each other. <laughs> just, just watch those two. I know it's hard not to watch the ball, but watching those two is a lot of fun. Three. Watson on the hop. T. Back to Bradley. He's got four on the shot clock. He knows it pulls up for the jumper. Player, a top ten national recruit out of Pike High School in Indianapolis. I love everything about him. Eric Bledsoe is exciting. Oh, Bledsoe has been outstanding. One of the Avery. Houston shooting 70% from the field. Lynn faked the pass, fires the three. Can't get it. Defensive oriented. Gritty grind it out. That's a two pointer. They, they'll play in the end of tomorrow, I believe you said. Yep. Uh, and that's a big game, obviously, in the Central. Late shot clock. Mail off the screen, looking to get on the board. That's been an issue for the Nets. Watch has been so good offensively, but his help defense defensively. Uh, Reggie, not a stranger to the flop move. Here's Wallace to the bucket. Dominic Jones is back in. So is Sean Marion. Those are the leading scorers for the Mavs. Six apiece. Chris Kamen on the move. He's got a smaller guy, Jimmy Butler. He's got uh, a January 10th date that uh, impacts his uh, contract and pay. As the three won't go. Player, and I totally agree. They've got a, a really impressive big three with Williams Johnson. And Lopez, but they really limited room in the half court, and everything has been in the half court to this point. Bulls now in early foul trouble. That was it. Williams back to Lopez. And that time, uh... if you win at 2 1, you're in a commanding position. But Brooklyn, if they can find a way to win, they're right back with Johnson coming off the pick from Evans. He sets it again. And a by Gibson just underway here in the fourth. Robinson up pressuring T. Jeff gets to the paint. Oh, oh, to get it off. Overall averages 15 a game. Oh. Lou Williams. Die with the two. Second unit. Sparking the Hawks. Something. They really have a great front line with Rudy Gay, Randolph, and Gasol. Courtney Lee. Gotta find him. Biggest lead of the game for Chicago. They're in front by five. Here's a spin. Vince Carter trying to break down the defense. Got a Bernard. Oh, down my the lane. God. I saw that coming a mile away. CJ Watson. Jones has five assists to go with the 10 points. Maybe he'll get another assist here. Crowder for three. When he come back? I don't understand. Shot clock. Marion appearing in his 11th game of the year. And Sean will get another opportunity. On by Rondo, off the dribble twice into the paint, made something happen. Rondo, pull up jumper, not that high. The defensively at both ends have just been you know, really outstanding. Garnett, down on. Rondo and Hamilton continue their conversation. Rondo drives, reverse layup. Sullinger on the foul. Pretty good position, but hard to get the call. 14 foul on Chicago. Parsons off the bounce. That's a two. They did. Are you well, pleased with what you see? Well, you know, so there's. Noah's got a bad foot. And Boozer, I think, uh, would really have some difference. And Dallas's short run of six straight points. They rebuild the lead into double digits. Nate Robinson defending. Al screens for him. Gibson forces on its own right now, though. 
the tough, hard-nosed physical teams have given. Got that motion of gravity to keep Joakim off the offensive glass. There's a uh, hard <laughs> It's hard to forget about games like this, but you have to. There's too many games in this NBA season for you to worry about one. 65-60 Chicago. Ivan. Corver feeding it back out to Pargo. Al with a little goals turnover. So Brooklyn just cannot afford to let Chicago get out into transition. A lot of shots are made. Now we've seen him go nuts in this building before when he wore a Knicks uniform. Here's Stevenson. From this sellout crowd here at Barclays. Lopez wide open as Again, wide open shot. Misses him as he does with a bunch of the members off his bench, as we'll get into later. Here's Morris. Come back to his whole much attention is on him. You're going to get open shot. John Jenkins. Fargo finds an open Josh Smith. Jeff against Marcus. Ivan screens. Back to Ivan. It is uh, PJ looking for some offensive help. Here's Brooks. He's wide open this season. Here's Blanche. Apparently all right as he remains on the floor. Here's Williams. Shirts today. Yeah, it's been 800 and, 862 days, guys, since the Bulls have played here. Carson sets to hard. Maybe you'll beat my Giants this year. Dang. Garnett and Noah, a fun matchup. Heinrich and Rondo, also a fun matchup. You beat me. Rondo resets. Rondo left open. Penetration of their own that time for the easy basket. Garnett pulls the trigger. Harden back into the game. Harden top of the key. Firing this. Guys like yourself in the position that you hold, that you live on the phone. Will you pretty much be doing that for next week? Well, they kept uh, Hamilton under control. Doc is really upset. Uh, how long it's taken for this to develop. Green kicks it to the corner, back to Bass. Bass going to have to shoot it. No, he gives it to Garnett. As well. Now here comes the screen. I see. Oh, that's Here's it. to Terry. Terry, the jump shot. It's good. Cool. Yeah, you put them in the category of Tim Duncan and Carl Malone, those kind of players. Gets the finish. I guess you can forget about time restrictions with uh, Noah. Into the hands of Pierce. Terry sets a screen on Butler. Pierce drives in. Back out Garnett. Open shot. It's good. Lopez with a deep one hand. Say the Warriors are a playoff team. Absolutely. Right now. It, it will be a dogfight for those last couple positions in, uh, in the Western Conference. Goes to work on Heinrich. Zaza with the screen. Boozer to switch. Scott, a two. Boozer's second. And remember, Noah on that minutes restriction. So we'll see how Tom Thibodeau plays it. Nice ball movement, Stackhouse. 